Oh, there you are. Now, come on, what's your plane at? Audrey, it's only five to. Yeah, I'm well aware what time it is. Thank you, Maria. I'm also aware there's a big ring of grime around the basin because somebody didn't clean it properly on Saturday, and I hope. Uh, oh, do you know, you're both as bad as each other, you. Now, come on, let's get it done. Hi, sweetheart. Hello. Actually, maybe I will have a quick cup of now, will you? Remember we've got Mrs Philpott's first up. She can complain if the water's too cold. Yeah, or too warm. Or too wet. Yes, but she pays your wages. And we're quite stacked up this afternoon and also we might have to work a bit later today. I can't. Pardon? Well, I've got a day. I'd change it, honest, but it's like my first proper one. And if I do change it, I might not get a second. And if you keep it, you definitely won't. Oh, ha ha. Oh, now, 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 now. Thank you, Mike, darling. Anybody we know? No, oh, she won't say. Which means it's obviously a minger if she's too embarrassed to tell us. Uh, oh, Candice, would you ask Sarah if I could have a piece of toast as well? Yeah. Maria, I thought we'd agreed to give Candice an easier time. You know what she's going through with her mother at the minute. Mm, right, OK. Yes. Do you know, I don't think you realise the impact you have on her. Me? Yes, you. She looks up to you. Do you reckon? Definitely. Yeah. All right, well, I'll cover for it tonight, then. Well done. Well, come on, who is it? Bez, it's none of your business. Right, what do you reckon? He's a drop-dead gorgeous hunk. That's why she's not letting mm. on. Well, look, I'm flattered you're even interested. Yeah, well, I'm not. No, so now you don't want to know? No. Well, that's a surprise, especially because you both know him. What? Do we? Yep. Oh, you know what, girls? I'd love to stay around and chat, but I've got to go and try my outfit on for tonight. See ya. Right, who's the hell is he? Well, you know what, who cares? See you later. OK. You put a date? Uh, yeah. Oh, where are you taking her? I don't know, for a meal. Yeah, but where? I don't know. Well, what sort of grub does she like? Indian, Italian, Chinese? Be, be handy to know if you're going to book, wouldn't it? You don't know. <laughs> what do you want, a pint? Actually, no, make it half. I should probably go and find out. Hello? Yeah, it's me. Can I come up? Uh, yeah. Hey, I was just wondering what type of food you like for tonight. <laughs> wow. Do you like it? Um, yes. Do you like it on or off? Both. I tried on a mobile, but it was switched off. Yeah, the battery's dead. But I think I prefer personal contact, don't you? Mm, definitely. So do you still want to know what my favourite food is? Well, not if it gets in the way uh, of, you know, this and that. We know him. Oh, he must be a right dog. Uh, where are you going? Back to the flat. I've got better things to do with me time than sit and wonder about Candice's love life. Yeah, me and all. Hang on, I'll uh, Shh. Well, what do you know? Lover boys are here. <sighs> so what? <laughs> well, come on, Maria, this could be a right laugh. Fizz, grow up. Do you not want to know who it is? No, I don't give a toss. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, girls, I didn't hear you come in. Oh, what a surprise. Well, come on, then. You're not going to introduce us to your lover boy. <laughs> hey. Nick? Ah, oh, doesn't he look cool in his suit? I love a man that dresses smart. You should have seen your face, Maria. It looked like you'd seen a ghost. Yeah, well, maybe I have. Um, I'll see you later. Right, well, if you just hang on a minute, I'll walk down with you. OK, girls, I suppose we'd better get back to work, eh? It's all go today. Oh, I don't envy you this afternoon. Why? Well, she's going to be unbearable, isn't she? She needs bringing back to earth. <laughs> yeah, with a bump. And you said you weren't bothered if we went out with. No, you said if you started seeing someone. Hello? Yeah, and that someone is Candy's. <sighs> Thank you. Give me a piece of that jacket, please. <laughs> but I'm meant to concentrate at work when she's throwing daggers at me all day. Plus, half the time she's got a pair of scissors in her hands. <laughs> uh, you'll ruin your appetite. Maybe I'll come back here for a sign it and you and him are at it in there. Yeah, well, now you know how Tyre felt. Except she was still going out with John. This has just happened. Yeah, right. <laughs> no, she's tricked me. She's planned this. What is your problem, Maria? You dumped the guy. Dog in the manger. 
She don't want her ex, but she don't want anyone else to have him. Do me a favour. It's a well-known syndrome. And she's welcome to him. Yeah, well, I'll have him, thanks. Yeah, well, he's soon boys to death anyway, with his daily updates on his stomach crunches and how many weights he's lifted. Don't think so. Oh, whatever. Ladies, ladies, now we've sorted out love and romance, whose turn is it to cook tea? I am not two-faced. Brenda Ferns is a, a flaming limpet. Oh, well, you were happy enough to eat that tea that she cooked for us, and you were happy enough to come out while she babysat. Yeah, and I'd have been just as happy stopping in. Oh, you're such a liar. Oh, look, Nick, they're having a domestic. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised to see you two in there. Is that local? What's that? Come on, you. Blood in, look. <laughs> it's next round. Please could I have a cider and black without the cider. I um, mean, you know. Right, dinner break today. Me and Nick were... You know, in the flat. Oh, too much information. No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. Only Fizz and Maria caught us. Maria were giving the old, like, I'm bothered, you're welcome to her and all that lot. Only her face was tripping her. Because <laughs> you're wrong. Um, that's all decent. <laughs> Don't doubt all that pouring over into my benefit. Oh, what a waste of time, eh? Considering you're not one bit bothered. <laughs> You know what, sometimes you can be dead antisocial. I mean, why did you have to go all funny at me when I made a suggestion to go out on a double date with Tom and Sarah? Well, I, I didn't. I just want you all to myself. Cool. Um, what should we get to the Chinese? <clears throat> I'm swallowing. I hope you're not expecting a drink on the wages you pay. How'd you get on with Preston King? Yeah, uh, fine, it's all in hand. And? And it's all in hand. Well, you make sure you keep on top of it. And your distraction's down to a minimum. What? And your lunch hour is 60 minutes. So I'm not allowed a girlfriend either. You can have a boyfriend as far as I'm concerned, Sunshine. As long as you keep sharp and focused like Hattie here. Otherwise, you two be swapping jobs. Isn't that right, Miss Rach? 